I'm 13 News Now meteorologist Seven Stewart. It is Friday, October 11th, and time now for an update on the tropics. Things a lot quieter than they've been over the past week. We still have the remnants here of Milton, no longer a tropical system. It was uh, downgraded and transitioned into an extra tropical or post tropical cyclone yesterday, and you can see the remnants there are passing just south of the island of Bermuda. And then we have Leslie that is kind of out in here, not really well organized at all. It doesn't look like much, although here in the last few frames, we have seen a little bit of a flare up of thunderstorms on the south side of it, but Leslie's not going to stick around for too much longer either. Right now, a tropical storm with winds of 50 miles per hour gusting up to 65. It's moving rapidly towards the northeast at 17 miles per hour. It's going to pick up that forward progress, then eventually head over towards the Azores by this weekend, transitioning into a remnant area of low pressure might impact areas over towards Europe or northern Africa as we head into the middle part of next week. So, Leslie, really no concern. And even by then, if it makes its uh, way that far. It's just going to be uh, just a little bit of a breeze with winds of 35 miles per hour. Elsewhere, we are watching this cluster of thunderstorms near the Cabo Verde Islands. Has about a 50 50 chance of development over the next several days. And it looks like once we get past Saturday, the environment is going to be less and less favorable. It is an area of investigation, according to the National Hurricane Center. So we are watching it and we are running models on it. And if it were to hold together through the weekend, then maybe there could be a little bit of development. But this is the seven day spaghetti plot. So these are all the different computer models. And you can see even seven days out, they bring it towards the Lesser Antilles in the Caribbean. So potentially something could develop as we head into the middle and the end of next week. But again, that's if it even survives this weekend. And right now the odds are about 50 50 of that happening. Of course, we'll always keep you updated on air and online with the latest in the tropics.